All right, y'all, so check this out. Brandy versus Monica was perhaps the most anticipated versus battle since the Instagram Live series kicked off earlier this year. Why? Because their history is marred by a long running feud and getting them to agree to a battle was a miracle in itself. But as Monica promised in an interview with Entertainment Tonight, the Versus platform was the ideal spot to put the feud to rest. The main event kicked off on Monday, August 31st at 5 p.m. PST, and before the two R&B superstars even arrived, over 500,000 people had tuned in. By the time they showed up, over 1 million people had tuned in. During the first half of the event, Brandy and Monica addressed the decades-long tension between the two and agreed all of the attention on it made it worse. They went on to express the mutual love and respect they have for one another despite their sordid past. Brandy also revealed Missy Elliott, who wrote and produced lots of Monica's material, played a role in getting her to agree to the verses in the first place. But there were a few awkward moments. At one point, things went momentarily left after Brandy attempted to make a joke about the time Monica slapped her backstage at a show, something producer Dallas Austin talked about in a 2019 interview with Vlad TV. People already think I'm abusive, Monica said, noticeably annoyed. Why would you say that? We had a disagreement. We know I'll kick in a door when it comes to the opposite sex. So I kicked down a door. Brandy apologized profusely and admitted she shouldn't have said that, noting, this will probably go viral. Thankfully for their fans, they moved on quickly and Brandy talked about an embarrassing moment she had with the late, great Tupac. Tupac walks by me and he says, hi Brandy, and I couldn't believe he knew who I was, she said. He's like, I wanna be down, right? And all I can think of, and I beat myself up for like two weeks after this, I said, West Side. <laughs> it was a mess. Later on, I heard my name on one of his greatest songs, so I want to play that. From there, she went on to drop Pac's Me and My Girlfriend before going into I Wanna Be Down featuring MC Light from her 1994 self-titled album. Monica then threw on her iconic single, Don't Take It Personal, Just One of Them Days before Brandy moved on to Baby. From the same aforementioned album and Monica hit her with Until It's Gone from 2012's New Life. As the two women continued to exchange songs and beautiful sentiments about their careers and relationships, Twitter couldn't forget that slap and promptly fired off plenty of comments and memes to mark the moment. But what do you guys think? Who won the versus battle in your opinion? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.